I'm Michael Madrigal. I'm in Studio 216, and I do sculpture and repurposed art. This is Lana. I'm Lana Yeager, and I'm in Studio 104. I do just a whole lot of things. I paint, digital art, art quilts. I just have fun. When we were asked about doing a collaboration piece for the show, I had a mid-century modern piece of furniture, uh, an Eames, uh, approximately 1970s uh, furniture piece that I wanted to do and collaborate with Lana. And uh, I thought this would be a great project for the show. Uh, I've had the chair for over, over 10 years and it was in very poor condition. The wood was bad, the metal was bad, the leather was bad. And uh, when I met with Lana, I, uh, we talked about restoring this piece of furniture and recovering it with some materials with, uh, with our artistic interpretation. So then we decided to take a trip to Tandy. We thought leather would work. So we went to Tandy, picked out some leather paints, came back and said, let's see what we come up with. Yeah, there was a little bit more involved with that. <laughs> uh, we had ideas of what we wanted to paint on here and how we wanted to do it. One thing led to another, to another idea, and then we came up with some idea that was a little bit more mid-century modern. And, uh, and then Lana painted away, and it we looks amazing. Fun. We had a lot of fun. But I have to brag on this guy's hard work. Look at the wood in this, and his logo, and the restoration. Talk about that. It was a lot uh, of work. Well, th this particular chair, there was, uh, it was stripped down and refinished. Uh, some of the wood was repaired, some of the metal was repaired and uh, refinished and I had to get it up to to where it was usable before we could refinish it but uh, the project went very well. The painting was just a blast it was just let's see let me try this let me try that it's just on leather you know expensive leather that was kind of the scary no, part. No, no pressure no at pressure. all. As I, as I drew it paint it's like I guess there's going to be a new square there. <laughs> There were a few moments I was a little concerned. But <laughs> overall, the project was a lot of fun. We had a lot of fun completing it, yes. and we're pretty satisfied yeah. with the results. If you don't mind, what I like about it is I have an idea that, uh, and I'm pretty specific about an idea, and some things work and don't work, but when collaborating with another artist, they give you a different perspective of it that really kind of opens the door to creating something really nice. And I believe that's what happened. I think so. And we had some good ideas. We were kind of little, we really weren't all over the place with it though. No. We kind of focused, you know, I grew up in the 50s and 60s and 70s and so to me it kind of seemed pretty easy. Pretty I, I thought of my childhood and one of my like, neighbors with yeah. funky furniture. I yeah. thought I get to create some yeah. of that. Yeah. It's I fun. I agree. It's okay. really comfortable on top of being pretty cool. <laughs>